Hi everyone. Um, today he's brought to me that something with the oxygen. I was going to do the dog, a little Fifi over here, because she's not usually in here. I've been keeping her out there with um, the other dog, but I'm thinking that's fair, but I don't know. She's been with me through thick and thin right by my side, so is it, who's a fair to? <laughs> the puppy or to her? But God said oxygen. The oxygen is very vital to a lot of people. Now, they're great to try to get around with. Sometimes they, they, they kind of let you down. I'm hoping I'm saying it the way God wants me to say it, not just what I think. I was headed out the other day to take care of something kind of important. And but all of a sudden started rah, 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 rah. but apparently there are filters and different things. So if you don't if you don't understand it, it's kind of um confusion, but confusion don't come from God. So, but I've had to her for a, for a long time, probably, I don't even know exactly when I got her. But, um, so, they're really cool, but they can be situations, if you see somebody that's in distress, that's on oxygen, you might want to kind of help them, because the companies, uh, tell you that that's on kind of that's on you at least at least from my experience uh, so let's pray that for all the people that's in those different situations Lord our Heavenly Father we want to lift them up because once once it goes and gets in any kind of a, a fall, it could fall and break. The people that are behind the oxygen thing are out of luck. There's nothing they can do. So when they call the people to say, help, help, nobody comes. <laughs> you have to call the ambulance or you'd have to call, you'd have to go to the hospital. But I guess you already know that, Lord. I'm, I'm just wandering around in my brain trying to talk to you and explain what you already know. So please be with them in Jesus Christ's name. Amen. Bye for now. God bless you.